Hey guys, what's up? This is Juggernaut here. Welcome back to another part of Strong Best Cool Game for Attract People. This time we're going to be doing episode 4, Dangerous 3. Dangerous 3, The Criminal Projective. Alrighty, so we're up to the second to last part of this game. And for something new I'm going to be doing for this part of the Let's Play, since I usually go over the 30 minute limit, I've set myself a stopwatch. So, 30 minutes to start now, and let's start the new game. Man, man, have I got a story for you. Yes, let's start the game. Always knew it would come to this. Did you think I wouldn't find out? Did you really believe that I would never discover the true face of my greatest enemy? That's right, but it doesn't matter now because I have the diamond! You mean this diamond? Yes! What? Oh yeah, right. Reply to all. Dear all the annoying morons that have been bugging me about it for four and a half years. Yes, I finally finished Dangerous 3. The criminal projective. So you can all eat it. The critics are stark raving. A dastardly, masterly masterwork of cinemagic wonder. More special effects than a Jessica Tandy joint. They may give you the whole tub of popcorn, but you'll only need the edge! Tickets are selling for like a hundred dollars a piece! Everybody who's anybody that gives me a hundred bucks is going to be there! Oh crap! I'm late for the premiere! Where have you been? Hey, we've been down here for hours! I think the movie. That's it. Okay, peoples! Here is the moment you have all been waiting for! The long-awaited premiere of Dangerous 3! Yeah? Well, I don't care what the FBI, CIA, RGB, and XFL say. I already returned the priceless paintings that were evidence. Dangerous plays by his own rules. Alrighty, so now we finally get to control the game a bit. Let's check out the Lappy for a second. Email inbox. Bullet Dear Dangerous, have you ever caught a bullet with your teeth? Because that would be awesome. Just wondering, Algar, worthless agent. Of course I can Unless get you're freaking Uvo again from Hunter x Hunter. Teeth. You learned that on, like, the first day of basic training at Crooked Cop Academy. You also learn how to mess with your superior officers in hilarious fashion and make cool noises with your mouth. Oh, I can also catch bottle rockets, musket shot, heat-seeking missiles, and rusty pennies that have been thrown off skyscrapers. And I'm currently working on my yellow belt and catching throwing stars with my eyelashes. Wink, wink. Huh. Bullshit. Well, you, well this is drama. You gotta believe whatever he says, though. <laughs> Alrighty, so... Phone. Hello? Commissioner? Do what to a rabbit? You got the... Oops. Stupid telemarket. Oh, let's check out the nunchuck gun. Ah, my trusty nunchuck gun. The only gun that's never out of ammo. Oh, because it's only using nunchucks. Alright, the trinket. Oh, broken half of a paperweight. 
You were the last thing my father ever gave me before he left, and the only thing I have to remember him. Of course, I might not remember him as such a cheapskate if he bothered to give me something that was whole. <laughs> Alright, so let's check the door now. Yeah, I should probably answer that. It's probably a gorgeous dame in desperate need of my help. Why, hello, beautiful. Hello, Dangeresque. It's me, Ronaldo, your partner. I'm here with your on-again, off-again, sometimes other partner with the same name as you, Dangeresque too? What's up, Big D? Are we late for the, uh, what's my line? Retirement party. Oh, yeah, retirement party? You know, because I retire in two weeks, and then I'm off to spend my days in the Sidekick Islands, where nothing can possibly kill you off. I bought cake. Huh. Alrighty, so now, let's pick up the Diet Cola. Diet Brown. All the fizzy with none of the flabby. Yeah, if I'm gonna hit the nude beaches on my retirement cruise, I need to start watching my girlish figure. It'll work even better if I just take it away. I'm confiscating this. Official corrupt police business. <laughs> Alright, so let's check the door one last time. <laughs> oh, I'll get... <laughs> I like how... Oh, I'll get the door. I like how they're just breaking their lines. Dangerous? Cutesy buttons! Are you here for Ronaldo's retirement in two weeks party too? Nope, I'm here because I need your help to save millions of helpless rainforest trees. Like this one. Marzipan, I told you not to bring your stupid plant! Credence is a natural movie star. He deserves to be in this movie. Anyway, I'm here because I discovered the location of a secret formula that will save the rainforest. But it's located deep in the jungles of strong Borneo. For me, that's far too dangerous. Not dangerous. Dangerous. What do you wow. say, guys? One last case as a team? Just for all this movie's sake? You bet, dangerous. We'll just grab the formula and come back. What could possibly go wrong? Yeah, definitely. What could Sorry, possibly buddy. go wrong? I can't. I've got, uh, something else. I have to keep my eye on today. You guys go on without me. Hmm. <laughs> Alrighty, so let's pick up this plant that freaking... The moody lighting and smoky atmosphere are being brightened too much by this plant. Maybe I should take it out for some fresh air and water. Okay, he is looking a little pale in here. Perhaps some sunlight Why would do him Why is the camera good. tilting a bit? <laughs> Did I forget it's being filmed? But who is the director? The treacherous of jungles of Strong Borneo. Let me just mark that location on my super high-tech global satellite positioning tracker keeper. All right, I'm assuming Strong Borneo will be somewhere like in the Amazon, so I will put it here. On to Strong Borneo. So here we are, braving the rapids of this turbulent river deep in the heart of the jungle. Gangs of angry street piranhas circle beneath us. Cannibals and volcanoes close in from all sides. And behind us, just out of view, is the 300-foot jaggedy waterfall from which we just safely dropped. Boy, am I glad you beat up that weightlifter ex-Navy SEAL we had for a guide and decided to captain this boat yourself. Your quick thinking and superior skills are the only reason we survive. Say that with more feeling, coach. Well, we aren't out of the boat yet. Now we are out of the boat. Great. Sir. Okay, according to this map, the formula should be around here somewhere. Look around, Ronaldo. But don't touch anything. All right, so inventory, nunchuck gun, stop sign. What could go wrong? Eh? Aha! Uh -huh. A secret area for stashing valuable items. Like, say, for example, oh, I don't know, the rainforest formula. 
All right, let's check and look in the hole because that's some complete mm, foreshadowing that strong bad dude. Something I can't quite reach it. Let me try. My arms are longer and stickier. No way, it's a trap. Look out, Ronaldo! It's a Western Lowland Grizzly Sharkosaurus bot, and it's holding a shark. No shit. Help! I'm trapped. Alrighty, so since we don't, this is the only thing solution right now. Use it. Uh oh, jam! Good thing there are two sides to every gun. Take that! And this! Oh, is that your liver? Well, here's my fist and a boot to the head and one for Jenny and the whip. What? <laughs> what happened to the monster? Oh. He's history and biology and a little metal shop. Did you get the formula? Oh no! I must have grabbed it too hard. It's turned to dust. Ronaldo! Not to worry. I know someone who can help. But you're not gonna like it. You don't mean. That's right. Deranged rocket scientist Professor Experimento. How could I forget? That whack job got me kicked out of the space program back in 83. Well, he's made a lot of scientific ish advances in formula reproduction. He could probably recreate Cutesy Button's rainforest formula if you bring him some of this powdery goop. Powdery goop. Alrighty, so we'll head to to Doctor Experimental's lab, mm, of course. The good professor's secret. Alright, so I'm assuming it's like in Cape Canaveral, so I'll put in the East Coast right here. Since you know rocket science, NASA, why not? So let's also check around here just to be sure. What's the wet area for? Quicksand. This place is full of deadly. All right, let's talk to Ronaldo. How are you feeling? Better now that you took care of that. It's what I do. Oh yeah. There's no way this old river. What about the plants right here? The jungles of strong Borneo have. Okay, that's pretty much it for now. So let's head to the secret lab. Eh? Oh, it's bubbles. Freeze, scumbag! Put what down the, the science and get up against <laughs> the, the wall. Notice the got posted hey, on hey, the fucking come wall. Come on, now, just everybody relax. We're here for a favor. Uh, let's grab those safety scissors. You gotta be more careful, Ronaldo. These things could have punctured your melon. And you only have two weeks till retirement. Oh, you know you can squeeze my head to tell if I'm fresh. I did not need to know that. <laughs> that could be taken so wrong in many different ways. Alright, so let's talk to the doctor. Let's be an angel. I gotta say, you turned out okay, Experimento. At least you're not still trying to contact hot alien races in the hopes of interplanetary prom dates. All right, that was me. <laughs> what about the formula? So you're some kind of expert on formulas now, huh? Okay, mister, you can't take a plastic bag full of scorpions into space. What's it gonna take to get you to recreate this top secret formula for me? Somebody stole a disk of important launch codes for your rocket and you want me to get them back? That sounds fair. You get me my formula and I'll find your disk. Whoa. What is he doing? What is it? What's going on? Ronaldo, what is he bubbling about? It's ingredients. He's figuring out what he needs to make the formula. A bubbly liquid, a flower from the rare stick and knee tree, and some yellow hair? Nice job. Looks like we'll be scouring the streets of Brain Blow City tonight. Alrighty then. What does he also have to say also? What about the rocket? That sure is some kind of ruby powered rocket. Yeah? Can it fly? Somebody broke in here and stole your computer disk of highly important launch codes? That's rough, man. Alright, that's pretty much it. Alright, so we got the bubbly drink we want to give to Doc to Dr. Experimental. Hey, look at that! 
I happen to have a carbonated liquid right here. Man, I'm good. I know it looks delicious, but it tastes more like one of Ronaldo's old gym socks. And trust me, you do not want to know how I became familiar with that particular taste sensation. <laughs> okay, you got your bubbly drink. Now make what the formula make. Ing. All right, so now let's head to Brain Blow City. I can't City. believe Brain Blow City isn't the default location in my travel log. I better add it now. Ah, uh, why not West Coast? All right, so Brain Blow City. Brain it is. Blow City, a town as hard as steel and twice as gray. She's like a fine lady type. Treat her right, and she'll make you cupcakes shaped like cold ones. But treat her wrong. And she'll kick you in the knees, step on your face with a stiletto heel, take your wallet, and totally ruin your credit score. Yeah, your woman scares me. I'll just wait here by the wall where it's safe. You go on ahead. All right, so we're ready in Brain Blow City, it looks like. Oh, there's a flower here. This must be the rare stick and knee flower that Professor Experimento needs for the formula. I'll just carefully remove this last delicate blossom. Well then, that's pretty much it, unless there's more stuff right around here. What does this whale want to say? Psst, code blue. I need some info. Right along, show off what you got. But I'm not in Rome. That'll be 2,000 yen. Fuck off, you stupid whale. Never help. All right, so, shark pond. Man. Those sure are some way under the water sharks. All right, so we're gonna be dropping Cadenza into the shark pond. Okay, box. stupid plant, can you swim? Cause you're about to get watered. Alrighty. Ha! That on it. That should though. Is there any more else? Oh, there's the photo. But why is there a cardboard box here? I can't quite reach it. Um, is there any inventory that I could use to get it? No, I can't. What else is more right here? Well, there is the cool car. Don't nothing to be doing it. City limits and all right. So you know what? Let's actually head back to the office. Alrighty, and now, let's examine the window. Hey, cutesy buttons. Why don't you take a look out the window? Shouldn't you be out getting my formula instead of hanging around the office? No, seriously, marzipan. I think you should look out the window. Aye, credenza. What have they done to you? Hang in there, little one. Oh, that's just mean. <laughs> <laughs> That's just me. And you know what? Since we need yellow hair. Kick your it's my line. <laughs> Got it. You go get Credenza right now or I'll. You're what? Oops. I rescued your plan from those bloodthirsty <laughs> sharks. Or leaf thirsty. Thank you, Dangerusk. Now, I think you should keep looking for that formula. She shut the pencil yeah, up, freaking. <laughs> safer out there with the sharks, anyway. Shut the pencil off a freaking strong bass's ear. Huh. Why don't I use the scissors again? Hold still. You've got a little something right on the side there. Ow, what are you doing, you animal? Stay away from my hair with those things. Marzipan, I'm supposed to get some of your hair in this scene. I told you I won't let you cut my hair for this movie. Come on, you're ruining the shot. <laughs> I don't care. Actresses. <laughs> All right, so and now we uh, get everything now. So now let's head to the secret lab. Alrighty, and now let's give him the fancy flower course. Here it is, a one-of-a-kind biogenetic miracle flower with the potential to eliminate sickness and disease from the surface of the planet forever and ever. I'll grind it into a goopy paste so I can take it back to some nerdy dame and get myself paid. Alrighty, and the yellow hair, of course. 
Okay, here you go. But man, you know what I had to go through to snip off Blondie's hair? That's right. So, uh, how's that formula coming there? Oh boy, here it is. It's the formula! He's done it, Danger Esk! You're okay, Experimento. Me and you, we's cool. Let's get this crap back to cutesy buttons! To the Danger Esk cave! I mean, office. To my office. <laughs> you don't have a cave. Don't even fool yourself. <laughs> so to the office. <laughs> well, Dollface, it was a dangerous and difficult mission. But after narrowly dodging herds of bullets, hordes of henchmen, and hordes of punches, I was able to recover your formula, and I didn't even break it and was forced to recreate it in a scientific lab even once. Huh. <clears throat> oh, oh, sorry. Oh my gosh, she's gone! Yes, but where did she go? You don't think... No time for that now. Cutesy Buttons is in trouble. There's got to be a clue somewhere around this office. Oh, I don't know. There's a TV here that we could probably use. I don't know. There's a hint. Okay, now, evil, right? Okay. Hello, Jaguarsk. If you're watching this, then you've no doubt discovered that I have kidnapped cutesy buttons. I also know that you have the formula for the rainforest. Well, I can't let that happen. So here is my list of demands. First, you bring me the formula so I can destroy it. I also want access to the world's weapon stockpile. And I want a million dollars in quesos. Who in a pony? Like, the kind with wings and rainbows? And, uh, can I get a large melanate? No ice. Thanks, Chief. Who was that guy? I don't know, Ronaldo. He seemed awfully familiar. Oh well, I'll start gathering up his demands. I think I know where I can get a used pony cheap. No way, Ronaldo. Dangerous doesn't give in to the demands of terrorists. We're gonna get back cutesy buttons my way. By finding his hideout and breaking into his hideout. Who do you know that can help us? Well, there is one person, but you're not gonna like it. Oh it's boy. It's your former enemy, Baron Darren Diamonical. Oh man, I hate that guy! Once he made me eat a whole bag of stale three-month-old moldy ranch-flavored potato chips! Ranch-flavored! So I framed him for endangered puppy trafficking and the murder of several <laughs> presidents. He's serving hard time in Brain Blow State Prison now. Wonder if he remembers me. Alrighty, so... I guess this is it for this part of Strong Bad's Cool Game for Attractive People Episode 4, Dangerous 3! The Criminal Exquisite, I believe that's the name of the game. Yeah, I believe that's it, but anyways, see you guys in the next part. Juggernaut, signing out. See?